<clears throat> Hello, friends. Yeah. So, uh, after researching Sandy Kid's device, I have no doubt he was completely successful in creating gyroscopic anti-gravity as a direction as a directional inertial force that can be used as a means of propulsion. Like Kidd, after watching Eric Lathwaite's uh, presentations on gyroscopes, I came to the I came to realize the anti-gravity potential of the gyro. Yeah, so uh, not sure if you can see that, um, but uh, DNA DNA spirals at roughly 33.5 degrees. Water likes to spin and will move with zero resistance when it's made to spin through a tube or pipe. Now water also likes to spin at that same uh, angle, 33.5 degrees. Electrons also like to spin around the surface of a piece of copper wire as they move through it. This is because electrons and water molecules are both gyroscopic in nature as everything in the universe is. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, here's some water moving through um, a pipe. Victor uh, Schuberger, uh, you know, has, well, studied water and learned uh, a lot of things about it. Uh, you can research that yourself if you want to. Yeah. Okay, uh, the gyros in Sandy Kid's device, I'm guessing, need to be set at, at roughly 33 and a half degrees to perfectly match the natural flow pattern of a gyro in motion. He achieved this by allowing the gyros to move a little bit so they could naturally move into the perfect angle needed for lift to be achieved. And that's right here. Um, this is uh, Sandy Kid's device. Uh, you know, his gyros can uh, move a little bit. If you want uh, greater clarification on that, you can watch the videos on YouTube of Sandy Kid's uh, device. Um, yeah, so uh, my device does not uh, do that, and that's probably why it doesn't work, why it doesn't work. I adjusted the angles to about 27 degrees because I was curious to see if this would work as opposed to my last video where I had the gyros completely flat. Uh, in my next video I will allow my gyros to move as Sandy Kid did. So yeah, that is all. Um, but before I leave you, I will turn it on, turn it on and uh, show you what it does. So yeah, I mean I have the scale on, but there's really no point because uh, it doesn't lose any uh, weight. But I'll still show you anyways. That's pretty loud. Thanks for watching. See you again next time.
Goodbye.